Who is looking here? Bouncy guys. Every time she fires a shot. So you can take cover here. Okay. Sayoko is serious. So Hinata doesn't take cover. She doesn't take cover. Very interesting. Hey, what is up guys? Guitar Rock here. A lot of you guys have reached out to me and told me about this particular fan-made game, Blue Archives Blue Division. And today, I finally decided to check it out, played it during my stream, and this is a fan-made game. If you guys are interested to download the game for yourself, I'll have the link in the description below. Alright, so without further ado, let's jump into it. Now, basically, it's a wave battle uh, similar to how the Tom Clancy's The Division. I, I never really played that particular one. But as you can see, you can purchase some things. Uh, you have like credits up on the top left, as you can see right there, right? Uh, obviously, you can also switch characters using the P button. Alright, so there's three characters that you can use, which is this NPC. And then you can also use a uh, Mob Chan right here, right? So Mob Chan is pretty cool. Uh, so you can see right here, right? This Mob Chan right here. So what makes this game really, really like kind of cool, right? In a way, is the ability to swap weapons as well. So you can see right here, if you want to, you can use up to two weapons. And these are the weapons that you have access to, right? Destroyer belongs to Hina. So you can basically use that on slot one. And then you can use uh, something like, let's say, uh, so far, I really am a big fan of the fresh chocolate mint. So that's going to be the one that I'm going to go for. As you can see, so this is uh, Hina's weapon, the destroyer right here. And then this is going to be the fresh chocolate mint, which I think is Iris one, right? So, oh, this one takes so long. Okay, so you can find uh, some of this stuff right here, abandoned fridge. This belongs to Iris, right? And then you can see just like that, we found her. Serena is right here. Okay, let's go. It's only two enemies here. So as you can see, you can recruit characters throughout. All right, so this is very, very cool, right? Uh, you can basically, there's Kayoko right here, which you can basically talk to her. And there's, it's like a wave base. You can see in the middle of the screen, next wave starts in a few seconds. And right now I'm wave 10, right? You can also buy these perks every single wave. For example, I like this particular one, the emergency call. You can purchase using your credits. So if I use it right now, I'm going to press my skill, which is F. I can summon a Mob Chan to come and join me in the battle. And I can summon up to two of them. So let's start the battle and show you guys what this battle, uh, how this game is, is played, right? So basically, you just go forward. All right, you can take cover. It's going to be a wave-based game. Okay. So there's going to be a number of waves of enemy. And right now, I'm using this particular gun. All right. So some guns, you can't take cover. Oh, this is Koyuki. Okay, that's very interesting. Oops. So you can also like rush towards them and John Wick style. Oh shoot, I'm almost dead. Oh crap. So as you can see, you know, every single wave, if you defeat the enemy, you're going to get a perk. All right, you can basically spec up or, you know, get better bullet ETC. And if you are injured, all right, you need to recover. There's this place right here. Zoop. Alright, let me move here. Uh, there is a... Right here, you can basically eat rations and you can pay out credits, obviously, from Fuuka right here. Alright, across the map, there's multiple different things that you can obtain. Uh, you can recruit Koharu, but uh, her book will be somewhere on the table right here. Uh, there, you can see. So far, these are the two secrets that i found so far. So it's her hentai book as usual, right? That way, Koharu is going to help you. I don't think there's any more. I've tried uh, exploring a little bit, maybe in the further wave, but right now we are at wave 11. Okay, so you can see Koharu has joined the gang alongside with, uh, what's her name? Alongside with uh, Ares right there. So can I summon the Mob Chan? I think I can, right? So the good thing about this ability is it allows me to, let me take cover here. I want to try a different gun. 
So the good thing about all the guns here, each of them have a very specific recoil. All right. And I think it's actually really detailed. Like every gun feels different, right? So this is Hina's gun, the destroyer. So you can see every gun plays extremely differently, which I find it very, very fascinating. Okay, so let's just um, press on the next one. So we got one mob chan here. Let's go in this cover. Boop, 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 boop. Uh, there's no sniper rifle gun as far as I know. But these are all the guns that we have. Okay, let me see if I can summon one more. You can summon up to two mob chans if you have the ability right here. Alright. Pretty cool ability. So currently at wave 12. So I'm going to push up a little bit and then, uh, you know, I'll see what I can show you guys later on. So again, sometimes there are some guns right here. For example, this one, the AKM. So you can basically recruit all of these. And I think I just saw one gun right here. This one is Shooting Star. Reza's gun. Ooh. Wait. If I got Reza's gun. Eh, hey, New Year Kayoko. Oh, I thought I'll be getting the regular Kayoko, but that's a New Year Kayoko. Uh, so far, I love Destroyer. I love the feel of the of the gun. So let me try Superstar. You can swap as follows. And the good thing is you can even configure all of this, right? For example, like adding a vertical grid muzzle or even like optics. Uh, these are like kind of like crazy customizability right here for one person to actually design this fan-made game. Uh, I love it, man. There's so much... Uh, there's so much stuff. There's even Momo Talk as well. So far, as far as I know, there's no relevant stuff. I haven't been able to obtain Shiroko yet. It feels like he's using Google Translate. So something is like off that case. Okay, so let's see. I am going to try this. So this is my... Sh oh, this particular... Okay, let me try Shooting Star. So is this a shotgun? Oh, wait, just like that. I don't even have to do anything. Okay. Ooh, this gun feels way more different. So this one, I cannot take cover. So some guns, you just can't, you just can't take cover if you basically use like a shotgun. Oh shoot. I don't want to die. Alright, let's hide here first. Okay, so let's just reload for a little bit. So obviously you can also swap to the other gun, right? It's not like you are forced to use that gun. But I really love this uh, Hina's gun, man. The destroyer is basically the most fun gun. I can basically go to the front, charge in if I want to. Ooh, I can see some of them charging towards, okay. So you can also throw grenade. Where's the grenade? Oh, there. Damn, it took a while. Um, you can also increase magazine capacity or just increase health overall, which is pretty cool. But every wave, every few, I think like every five wave, you get to recruit like one new character. Let me see if I can get up to wave 19 and then show you guys afterwards. Okay, so I am at wave 20 right now. Apparently, I'm going to fight the rabbit squad. Help, Koharu! Koharu is supposed to help! Oh no! Koharu died! Koharu died! Oh no! Okay. Mari, Hinata. 
I'm getting destroyed right here. Am I the last one? Oh shit. Alright, the highest difficulty. I'm not making it. This game can actually get really, really challenging. Damn. So yeah, let me know what you guys think of Blue Archives, Blue Division, a very, very cool fan-made game. Hey, just showing you guys some of this cool stuff. Uh, I, I definitely love exploring like, you know, fan-made stuff once in a while, right? This is pretty cool actually. It's really, really cool. Uh, the amount of effort put here is kind of crazy. Apparently the developer is just one guy. I will link his YouTube video uh, as well in the description below. So make sure you guys, you know, if you are interested, feel free to download it, support the, the, the dev. And with that being said, I'll see you guys in the next one. Stay tuned for more Blue Archive. I'll have some videos coming out soon, right? Have a nice day. Good. Bye.